Okay, so let's proceed now with the emergency lighting. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to building number one. And let's see if I have something here. So I have one coffee shop entrance. Okay, let's go to the plan view instead. All right, so I have here um, coffee shop. Okay, the story one. So this is the whole building. And for example, I want to put some emergency light maybe somewhere here okay let's open the label all right so this is the kitchen area i will try to put an emergency on the kitchen area yes i'm going here at the calculation object tab and then i'll go in the emergency emergency surfaces and then i will select a create anti-panic surface for a space so i will choose the kitchen there you go all right so it seems that it is 0.5 offsetted from the wall. Okay. And then if I want, for example, to create an emergency, that's just the full scholar, luminaire. So what I'm going to do is I'll go to, wait, let's check. Minimum is 0.5 lux. Unif uh, uniformity is 40. Okay, so these are the options. And then if I want to uh, create luminaire as an emergency, let's try to use this one down light as an emergency, use as emergency luminaire. Okay, and then I will turn on the false color. I love it. How about this one if I want as an emergency? Okay, looks really, really cool. And this one I will use as an emergency also. And I can see that I already achieved uh, um, the requirement for this one. So let's go and try to calculate it. Calculate active light only. Okay, let's see. That is so cool. Did I achieve? I think so. Yes. Yep. This is really amazing. And for example, this is a corridor going out. Because this is a restaurant if i want to have um a escape route so i'll go to the calculation object tab again and press the escape route and then i will draw it here so i'll go from because this is the main entrance so i'll go for example like escape route um yeah like this okay and then right click and end I'll say yes. Oh, look at that. And then if I go back to the light tab and select the luminaires that I'm going to use as an emergency. Oh, look at this. Okay, if I don't want this one and I will remove it and use this one instead. And this one also. <laughs> This is really, really amazing. Okay, and if I go now to, for example, the calculation and go to my um, PDF report. So let's see. Okay, I can see on the right side that the report says I achieved both of the requirements. And if I go to the documentation and I will only select the emergency for the kitchen. So this is my emergency lighting report. Perfect. I love it. Nice. And if I want to add the false color. Oh, false color is not here. Okay. Anyways. Okay. And how about for, for the corridor? Yeah. There you go. Okay, so my corridor is connected to the dining area. All right, I think this is it's good. Amazing. All right, so that's it. And I think this new Dialux Evo is... I will rate this one as 5. Definitely 5 star. Yeah. I hope that the next upgrade is going to be... It's going to be the sports lighting and also if they can add tunnel much better 
All right, so download now this Dialux Evo 10. Go and check in their website. And yeah, so if you have questions, just let me know. And they have also an emergency lighting video. Go and check this one, okay? So this is a tutorial about how to use the emergency lighting. Hey everyone, with the release of... Okay, so yep, see you again on the next video. Oh, sorry, before I forget, I would like to add something on the emergency calculation because some of the fittings, like for example, an LED fitting will only give a few percentage of the lumen output. Say for example, this fitting that I uh, selected as an emergency fitting, it says here that the luminous flux is, um, it says here that the emergency lighting factor is 100%. So sometimes the LED fitting only has, say for example, 20%. So if we reduce it to 20%, look what will happen. And if we calculate it, yeah, it will reduce the lumen output, but since here it's still achieving the lux value. So be careful, check the emergency fitting, the LED fitting especially, if the, the, the emergency factor is 100%, 50% or only 20% because some luminaires has this certain percentage for an emergency version. So that is for the additional right now. All right. So see you again on the next video. Bye. And if you want to learn more about lighting design, go and enroll in my lighting design courses at www.udemy.com. Check all available courses there. And of course, don't forget to check my website, www.enrocolightingdesign.com. And if you want to, to read my books, go and visit amazon.com. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. All right. So see you again on the next video.